Now, let's solve for the measure of variation of a group frequency distribution table. So, we have here the frequency and their marks. The first step is getting the midpoint. So, I'll just insert something here. Uh, the midpoint here is 62, 67, 72, 77, and 80. Now, we'll get the x, uh, f multiplied to x, m and the f multiplied to x, m raised to 2. The midpoint raised to 2. Okay, so let's solve. Um, this one, multiply this one. Um, x, m divided by the frequency. And I'll just drag it down. Now this one. Frequency multiply to this one, but raise to two. Again, you have to raise it to two. And then we have that. And then I'll drag it down. Now, let's sum everything. So for the sum, let's sum the frequencies. Let's also sum the 2. So we have the sum of the frequency, the frequency multiplied to the midpoint, and the frequency multiplied to the midpoint squared. Uh, now let's solve for the variance. For the variance, what we will do is we will use this formula. We have n multiplied to this one. And we minus it to this one, but raised to 2. Again, n multiplied to f, midpoint squared, minus f midpoint, pro product of f midpoint, raised to 2. And then we divide it to the numerator, uh, to the denominator of yan, multiplied to 60 minus 1. Okay, always put a parenthesis on your numerator and a parenthesis on the denominator. So Excel will know that they are separated. And I will click enter. And that is the variance. Now the standard deviation is the square root of the variance of this one. And that is the standard deviation. The mean, I think you are familiar with the mean. The mean is just this product divided by the frequency. And we have that. And the coefficient of variation, the coefficient of variation is a standard deviation divided by the mean. Standard deviation, we divide it with the mean. And then we click enter. But normally, the coefficient of variation is written in percentage. So I'll just convert that to percentage. We have now 7%. And this is how we solve for the measure of variation or also what we call the measure of dispersion of a grouped frequency distribution. Thank you for listening.